Hi, I'm Tori, and I'm an Education Program Manager at Google. Specifically, I work on our digital literacy curriculum called Applied Digital Skills that helps learners of all ages learn the practical digital skills needed for the jobs of today and tomorrow. So scope is important because if you have a well-defined scope in the beginning of a project, it'll help make sure that your team members, your stakeholders are all aligned and on the same page right from the start, and you can avoid any issues down the line um, that may come up that you might not have been aware of. Some challenges of staying within scope could be what we like to call scope creep. And these things can happen if, for example, you have some stakeholders that have some certain needs, desires, or requests that may actually end up changing the scope. Scope creep is when the scope changes after you've already started the project. And this can be really challenging to manage if you don't keep an eye on it from the beginning. I was recently working on a project where we were hoping to actually reach underserved communities with our digital literacy curriculum. And the initial project scope started off focusing on middle and high school students. But at some point down the line after the project started, there were some stakeholders who actually wanted to expand the audience to adult learners. And so we had some trouble trying to figure out how we were gonna manage that. Were we going to change the scope? Were we gonna keep it the same? And ultimately we decided to keep the scope the same and referenced back to our original goal in the beginning. Because if you think about it, changing the audience would make the project goals and our strategies for reaching those audiences drastically different. Um, so ultimately we ended up keeping the scope and communicating that to our stakeholders. Some best practices for managing scope is just make sure you document everything in the beginning and share it with all of your stakeholders and team members and make sure everybody's in agreement on that scope. There are times where the scope may need to change and that's okay, but you have to be able to make sure that you can also change and potentially change your timeline, your resources, or even the budget to accommodate that scope change. Congratulations on finishing this video in the Google Project Management Certificate. Access the full learning experience, including job search help, and start to earn your official certificate by clicking on the icon. To view the next course in this video, click here. And subscribe to our channel to learn more from Google Career Certificates.